Hey y'all, I'm gonna show you part two on Mountain My Redhead, but right now I'm fixing to spray paint the goose that I killed in Arkansas. It's beak and feet, and I'm just gonna briefly show you how I do it. Not saying it's right, but it is how I do it. Hope you're having a good day. Thanks for watching. All right, you just, I'm just gonna pull down the trigger a little bit and test it out right here. It's, I haven't been doing a lot, but I just see how it goes. I did a white and a yellow base coat but that's just me. I'm gonna do black in a little bit. I just wanted it to look pretty natural. I'm gonna use some lacquer thinner on the paint that's on the face and on the fur, but just moving it around. You can actually, I saw on McKinney, McKinsey's website, you can get um, the, that's where I ordered my, mine for my, um, spray painting, but I found one on Amazon for a little bit cheaper. I think it's about $97, but just doing a little rundown to get it orange, and then I'm going to go over my nostrils and everything with the black, so pretty easy. Um, bright right now but good so far and then got my feet here I'm gonna hit them a little bit okay. still got my uh, Arkansas stuff all underneath the four wheeler hadn't cleaned that out yet and a little Lazy here. Okay. Honestly, if I can do this, you can do this. This is my first duck that I have painted because I've been buying their heads. See, that looks like crap. <laughs> it's funny. But anyway, so I just makes it look a little natural. Uh huh. So. I'm just showing you the real deal. So you just paint the nostrils black. Okay. So it's taken me a while. It's my first one. I've been buying the heads already painted, but to save money. I've been doing it myself. But boy, has it been a, a, a humdinger for sure. Okay. So, if I can do it, you can do it. Pretty easy. I mean, not really. But, common sense. This is also my first time ever videoing anything. I don't have social media or anything. I'm kind of a stick myself and hunt and fish. I don't really do a lot of outdoor activities other than hunt and fish and hang out with the family. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is dip this in alcohol. My garage looks like here right now probably going to be moving, so I haven't bought a building to do this in. I really just do it in my living room, but so you can go back over it with the orange, but that nostrils will be painted. I bet a real taxidermist is probably watch this video and cringe, but it works for me and saves, saves about a few uh, hundred bucks. Anyway, I think it looks pretty dang good, though. Okay. So, I'm going to do this nostril and go back over the orange where I wiped off. See, it's hard to get the pressure. I don't know. I practiced all over this box before I started.
I'm gonna wipe off the black, touch up the orange, and I'll be done. But I think it looks pretty good. Pretty dang good. Okay, alright.